What is layer editor in Maya? By the end of this video, you will understand what is this layer editor and how to use the layer editor and what are the uses of using layer editor. As you are already might be familiar with layers in Photoshop and other digital softwares. As the name indicates, you can create different types of layers to organize your scene objects. For example, I'm, I want to disable all these things. See now, you are not seeing anything in the Maya. That does not mean that the, those objects are not present in Maya. They are simply hidden from the layers. See when I click the visibility on these, this entire kitchen set is uh, present in this layer. If you want to rename this, right click, click on the layer 1. Now you can name it as a kitchen set. And you can change the color if you want. Okay, this colon is not uh, accepting it. Save. Even that is also not accepted. Save. See, something like that. You can use numbers, but you can't use uh, spaces and uh, other uh, alphanumeric characters. That you need to know. Simply, even double clicking here will open this. And uh, there are different modes. For example, if you keep this as a template, template mode, kitchen, reference mode, all these objects are in this layer. Just click on this plus button and it creates a new layer. Select that layer, select an object and right click on here. To add the selected objects. See here, now if you make this off, whatever the objects added to this layer becomes invisible. If you click again, that's visible. But when you click here, this is the template mode. T means template. Means you can't select. Whatever the objects present in this layer can't be selected. This is reference mode means you can see the shading mode but you cannot select and the normal mode this is normal mode that is uh, that is what is layers in uh, layer modes in Maya and even animation layers are present here but uh, they will be discussed in the animation section but right now try to understand you can create as many layers as you want you can add the objects to that layer and you can rename that layer and you can assign colors and you can do many more so that you can organize your scene objects into different layers so that you can work easily and happily.